Yo, what up you guys, Bacardi here, and today I'm going to be checking out an EP from a duo that I actually haven't done any reactions for, but I did listen to one of their EPs earlier this year and heard a song of theirs actually like two years ago that I absolutely love, and I feel like I'm going to butcher the name because it's really hard to say, but here we go, Bull Ball Gone 4, I don't know if I said that right, but you know, you can just abbreviate it, Bull 4, or like... What's their other name? They have another name. Blushing Youth. Yes, Blushing Youth. So yeah, I'm going to be checking out their newest EP, uh, 2 Five. Now, uh, like I said earlier this year, uh, I listened to the Red Diary page one, and that EP was absolutely just beautiful to listen to. Um, I loved it. I loved it. The song Sung, um, like I said, I first heard it two years ago at Mama Awards 2017, and it was catchy then, but... I didn't actually really listen to it until this year, and when I remembered it, I was like, oh yeah, that song is so good. Listen to the EP, and I was just like, wow. They are like really talented, the two of them. So it's Ji Young and Ji Yoon, if I said that correctly, and yeah, um, don't know much about them. Other than that, they are really talented, man. I mean, I only heard one EP, but that's enough to let me know uh, that they're both really talented. And um, I was going to just listen to their other EPs throughout the year, but... You know, they would just drop this one, and I figured, why not? Let's just listen to the whole thing and do a reaction to it. Um, so, figured let's just get straight into this. The first song is Workaholic. All right. I really like her voice, man. Okay, I like that. Liking like the lyrics and the message of the song.
了我。Damn, it turned into an episode of SmackDown. Nice, man. Okay,、uh, where do I start with that song? First off, extremely relatable.、Um, if any of you work in any sort of job where it's the same thing day after day,、uh, having well, maybe terrible boss, maybe dealing with terrible、um, coworkers, maybe having to deal with terrible customers, whatever sort of mundane day-to-day -day job you have, where. Your one solace is like when you get home and you can have some drinks and like really wind down. Like that's that's like your moment of zen, you know. If you can relate to that, this song will like this song is for us, okay? <laughs> this song is for us.、Um, yeah, I love the message. I love the <clears throat> lyrics and just the sound. Again,、um, you know, they they're really different from、mm, most of the K-pop that I listen to.、Uh, I've like I said I've only heard one EP and、uh, that's kind of all I'm going off. But I think I think I can safely say、uh, their music's like different from you know most of what I listen to, and I really like that. I really like that.、Um, there's just two of them.、Uh, this song was mostly just one of the members,、um, Ji Young, Ji Young. So it was just her like singing for the most part. I'm guessing Ji Yoon.、Um, Probably had her hand in like production and whatnot, but yeah, she was only in the music video、um, for a little bit there. So yeah, didn't see her much. But the song itself,、uh, I really enjoyed that. I really enjoyed that. But I definitely enjoyed like the music video and lyrics and meaning a lot more. That was really nice, man. That was really nice. Okay,、uh, next song on the EP is Twenty Five. I think this one has a music video too. It's gonna lonely, lonely. Sometimes I turn like you're in the car. It's gonna be boring. I was not expecting that. So far, both songs really relatable.
또 시간이 지나면 다 잊혀질 거야 이 순간의 기억도 아마 내일의 큰 꿈도 이 25만 나도 모르게 찬란히 빛나가 When I'm 26, 29 세상이 밤만 날아가 미웠던 그 기억도 조금만 더 조금씩 배워가 좀 아프더라 또 한편의 멜로 영화처럼 괜찮아 25, 25 We all know Um, again, really relatable lyrics. Uh, um, pretty much everything about it. Um, you know, I'm 28 now, and sometimes I think back and I'm like, man, where have the last like 10 years gone? It's like, what have I been up to? And then I think about what I've been up to, and I'm like, oh yeah, yeah. Haven't really been paying attention. It's like 10 years kind of go by like that a little bit. What did I do when I turned 25? I was just working every day, I think. Yeah, yeah, just working every day. Man, if you're in your early 20s uh, and you like are thinking about doing something and you're hesitant about doing it, man, just go for it. Seriously. You don't want to look back when you're like 30 plus and be like, oh, man, I wonder if I could have really done it, you know? You always hear people tell you that. I'm serious. I mean it. Do it, okay? Don't worry about um, not being successful or something. You just, like, at least give it a try, you know? Yeah. But this song, uh, again, like the first song, really relatable lyrics and just the sound of their music is just enjoyable, you know? It's it's the type of music you just sit back and listen to, kind of. Not that there's anything wrong with that, right? But I mean that in the best way. It's just like, it's really comforting. Her voice is really comforting too, man. I really like her voice and the production and everything. Um, the music video too. Um, they seem to have like a lot of fun with it, you know? Um, her name, uh, Jiwoon, she seems like really fun. Like that part where she does a 2-5, like, she seems cool, but um, a lot of the attention is on um, Ji Young. So, I don't know if that's just like the company thing or whatever, but yeah. They both seem really cool though, and they seem like fun spirits, you know? Yeah, that's nice. I really like that. Yeah, really good song, really good song. Okay, next song is XX, or Multiple Multiple, if we're going by like Luna names. All right. Slow it down. Okay, I just had to pause it there to kind of say something. Um, I don't know if it's just because her voice is so fantastic, but on every single song of theirs I've heard so far, her voice works so well with the instrumental. Um, it just it just fits. I can't really explain it. That's the best way I can put it. It just works well. Um, yeah. Yeah, she has an amazing voice, but the way it works with, um, you know, whoever produces it and everything, it's just like, it's really good, man, on every song I've heard of theirs. <laughs>
it's just so enjoyable to listen to. Ken really good. Okay, that song is my favorite so far of the EP. Um, I really like 25, but this is just very calming, soothing. Um, yeah, definitely my favorite so far. Um, <laughs> Jiyoon, um, I thought she was gonna get like some lyrics or something in here, but uh, no. <laughs> so that's weird. Um, yeah, I don't know how the dynamic works in the duo. It's like, um, obviously she's the main singer, so yeah. Um, and I think she's the rapper, so, but so far she hasn't had any lines, I think. Um, yeah. Even when I listen to, um, uh, Red Diary, page one, I only listen to the music, so, and it's been a while, so, kind of forgot, like, um, how much they each got, but really, I always hear, um, Ji Woon or Ji Ji Young, uh, more. Her voice is the one that's always like carrying the song. Um, I don't know if that's just how it is or, you know, how that works, but yeah, she's definitely like the centerpiece of the songs. Um, but she's really good, so you see why, you know. Um, yeah, that song. Like I said, very calming, very uh, soothing, really nice to just listen to. Okay. Um, Next song, Taste. I also like how they go back and forth with the little English parts right there. I wonder how many people learned that word because of this. So she's talking about not wanting to well, wanting to be loved, but also. Okay. 
Okay, so I was like trying to like uh, figure out what the lyrics were kind of trying to say, you know, um, hating things that are sweet, but also sweet things are addictive, you know, so um, love is the same. Uh, I'm guessing she's talking about love and kind of just like, um, almost like falling in love is like a burden, you know, you know, um, it can go bad. <laughs> you, you never know. You never know. Um, yeah. So far, of all the songs on the EP, this one would be like uh, rank fourth. Cause four songs so far, this one's fourth. Not that it's bad or anything, but it's just like the other three were uh, really good. This one was just good, you know. This one was just good. Um, yeah. But again, very, just really nice to listen to, I think. Like, that's what I'm going to keep saying. It's just like really enjoyable to listen to, you know. Uh, for me personally I think yeah okay um last song well not really last song day off feeling this is gonna be really good. This sounds like the ending song of an album. No, I don't know why I didn't say it before, but um, obviously Jiyoon, she's like a guitarist, right? It's every song I've heard of theirs, it's been like she's been really good, man. really nice that was really nice man um kind of similar to um xx but uh a bit more upbeat uh that song almost sounds like something you listen to when you wake up in the morning <laughs> almost like an alarm clock uh song you guys ever had that alarm clock songs songs that play to like wake you up yeah i had some of those that sounds like something you would play to like wake up to you know like on a sunday really nice really nice um yeah okay so there's still one more uh an acoustic version of xx let me see okay so there is an acoustic version but it's pretty short it's a minute 35 so let's just listen to it
feels like any version of this song is really good. really nice again yeah so like i was saying um any version of that song is like it just sounds good right that almost sounded like it could have been the official version uh that ep every song was good uh two of them in particular being like really really good well actually i'd say four um workaholic 25 xx and day off taste was the only one that was like okay-ish um but the other four, really, really good. Um, especially XX, um, 25, and probably Day Off. Yeah. I really enjoyed that EP. I really did. Um, you know, it didn't blow me away at the first listen like the Red Diary page one did. But it's, it's good enough that I'm easily going to buy it, of course. Uh, yeah. I definitely need to check out their other work too, man. Because they, I think, make music... For someone like me, uh, at my age now, um, but also uh, just musically, it's really enjoyable to listen to. Uh, and it's a really nice change of pace from a lot of the K-pop that I listen to. Um, like, I definitely need this in my life. So yeah, definitely need like lyrics like that and a sound like that in my life. And I'm glad they're making music like this. It's really nice. It's really good. So yeah, definitely enjoyed the EP. So yeah, let me know. Um, I might do more reactions to their uh, other older work, but you know, it just depends, you know, because uh, I don't know how copyrights work from like albums from two, three, two years ago, even a year ago, you know, you never know. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed, you know, and yeah, if you did subscribe uh, and yeah, peace, love, have a blessed day. See you in the next reaction.